Hey everyone, this is Justin from TechUnfolding.com, and I'm back again with another episode of Tech Tips, showing you how to secure your computer for free with both antivirus and spyware programs. Alright, so for the first uh, free program that I suggest, it's, uh, it's AVG Antivirus. Its virus protection is free and uh, it has the most up-to-date uh, virus definitions available to you. And I'm just going to quickly go through and show you some of the highlights of this free virus protection. Uh, so you have your overview, you have your antivirus link scanner, so when you're in Google and you do a Google search, it will tell you if that link is safe or not safe. Uh, resistance shield, anti-spyware shield, um, Update manager, license, a whole bunch of stuff. Computer scanner. You can uh, change your scanning settings to search in certain spots and locations to do as many drives as you want. Um, you can do specific files or folders. Uh, this can be done in numerous ways. The first way it can be done by if you have a file and you want to uh, search the file or that archive for viruses just right click on it and you can just scan the file immediately just that one file will be scanned uh... you have the update which it uh... downloads the latest updates just by clicking that and uh... that's about it it's just a basic antivirus free free spyware free antivirus program and uh... it gets all of the most up-to-date, uh, all the most recent viruses, and uh, I highly recommend it to anyone who uh, who wants to sec secure their computer for free without spending uh, on for programs such as McAfee or or uh, Norton Antivirus, which not only you have to pay for, but they are actually memory hogs as well. All right, so the next part here is we're going to be looking at a couple free, free anti-spyware programs, and we're going to be looking at two: both Spybot Search and Destroy, and Adware Free Edition, the Anniversary Edition. And you might be asking, why two? Why not just one? Well, going by the basic premise, two is better than one, and both do what they do very, very well. And with two, you know, you'll make sure that you get all the protection that you want and when you do both scans you know that you're going to get everything any kind of anti spy any kind of spyware on your computer all right so and just looking at each spybot does a great job of protecting your computer and preventing any kind of spyware from entering your computer by having its immunized uh, settings well adware has a really deep scanning feature and we'll probably find more more items using that than if you did a scan using Spybot. All right. Anyway, let's start here. Let's start by looking at uh, search and destroy. And just looking at some few features. You have your uh, your search check for problems. Uh, you can do a recovery if you notice any uh, any problems have occurred since you've removed since you removed a uh, previous spyware. And you have your uh, update. Uh, let's go here. We have uh, your immunize, which this is what I said. It will protect your computer from any incoming uh, spyware or malware that can possibly get infected just by doing some protections in the cookies and blocking domains, plugins, and that sort of thing. And uh, your update. And there's also a tool setting down here, which allows for a whole bunch of other settings, such as changing uh, startups, and uninstalling programs, shredder. And there's a shredder here for shredding your files, and uh, that's basically it. If you um, if you want more, just go through the program and take a look at it. Uh, next uh, is the Adware Free. As I said, this is a very good scanning program. We'll find lots, lots of, uh, lots more uh, spyware and ad malware than uh, than search and destroy, just because the scan is so much better. And uh, so you have you have your your main here. You have your update. You don't get ad watch live. That's only if you upgrade. 
and uh, so if you click scan you can do a full scan, a smart scan uh, the ba basic difference between a full and a smart is it's going more in deep and uh, going to archives and that sort of thing and uh, profiles you can also do select a specific um, specific uh, files themselves and then search them just like I showed you in AVG and there are also a few little extras here by sweeping your computer, Firefox, Internet Explorer, the cookies, the stuff like that that you normally do within the the Firefox or Internet Explorer settings. And that's about it. Uh, for more information or uh, to, to get your latest tech news, make sure to visit our we website, techunfolding.com.